Wow, from here you can see the whole tent, there are many people. I thank you all, all for coming. Thank you so, so much for this uh, overwhelming, overwhelming love that, uh, that uh, you, you have demonstrated. Uh, honorable ministers, honorable members of parliament, I find the CDF, generals of the UPDF, uh, the executive committee of MK48, <laughs> team MK, team my chairman. <laughs> All of you distinguished uh, ladies and gentlemen, it is an honor to be with you here today as you join me to thank the millions of young Ugandans and East Africans who have given a whole new life and meaning to what began as a simple call to celebrate my 48th birthday. The famous Nigerian author, Chinua Achebe, said, when we gather together in the moonlit village, in the moonlit village ground, it is not because of the moon. Every man can see it from his compound. We come together because it is good for kinsmen to do so. When I extended the invitation to you to come to this place in Tebe Cricket Ground, it is not because you couldn't have a bite or a drink in your own homes, but rather that we congregate because we are kinsmen and women, united by a strong bond of common purpose and belief. As most of you are aware, a couple of weeks back, as my 40th birthday uh, was approaching, I mooted the idea, using my Twitter, that we use the occasion to celebrate our spirit of resilience and our brotherhood, especially considering the tough season we have just been through of the COVID-19 pandemic. My idea was that like-minded young people would use this occasion to fraternize, celebrate, and celebrate the gains made despite the challenges of the pandemic, and importantly, reflect on what role and contribution we could make in the advancement of our country and our I must say that what has followed has been overwhelming. The outpouring of love, solidarity, but importantly hope from, uh, from our people has been unprecedented. From Bushenyi to Mbarat, Fort Poto, to Kitgum, to Mbale, Karamoja, I have seen millions of young people using the MK at 48 uh, mantra to organize not just social activities, but also cause discussion on what more we can do to make our wonderful motherland even better. It is this unexpected wave that uh, has humbled me immensely. That a simple birthday celebration has offered an entry into wide and varied discussions. But importantly, uh, importantly, those were our young people. Uh, those were our, our young people have been reflecting on their critical role in nation building. I can guarantee all our young people 
is that UPDF remains steadfast in ensuring Uganda stays peaceful and secure. I am glad that young people today, more than ever, appreciate our army, what our army is doing. I therefore celebrate all my comrades in arms and thank you very much, Afan CDA, for taking the time to come and be with us. I know you're very busy. And all the other generals, thank you for coming. I must also thank my mother, Honorable Janet Katam Sibini. everything she did to raise us. It was not an easy job, but she's a strong woman and she managed. She managed. I must thank my wife, Charlotte. Although she's here, she's here, she's with us in spirit. I must thank my children, all the members of my family, thank you very much, senior members, led by Uncle Nzere, young Uncle Nzere, uh, and the rest. Um, finally, I want to thank, in a very special way, uh, the executive committee The executive, uh, uh, MK48 Executive Committee, led by the Chairman, Honorable Chirio Achiwanuka. If he can stand up, please, uh, Honorable. Where, uh, uh, please come here. Come, come. And all the other members of the, of the Executive Committee. If you can come forward here so people see you. Some of them are, more, are better known than others. If you can stand with your chairman.